No intro music today. We're going straight into rogue actions because we got stuff we got to get to, Heinze. We're a day late, but we got good stuff. Heinze, how you doing? Better late than never, mate. How are you, brother? How are you, Cubs fam? Hope you're all well. Everything's all great uh, down under today, mate. We're getting some good weather coming our way now from here on for the next uh, oh, six yes. months. So we're, we're getting to the good side of it now. That, so that's happy for us too. Well. Like a lot of people in the U.S., they're getting, you know, they're bracing for the, the bad season. But here in Arizona... It's sweater weather, and that's it. We're gonna we're gonna live yeah. in sweater weather for the next three, four, five months at least. Well, I've I've actually got four days off. I've actually got four Ooh. day holiday right now. We're in the middle of it, and believe it or not, this is hilarious. You guys uh, over in uh, in the US, you guys have the uh, Kentucky Derby, I think it is, if that's right, the horse race over there. Yeah, but only like weird people pay attention to that. Okay, all right. So down in Australia, we have a horse race here as well, right? Melbourne yeah. Cup. Uh-huh. Yeah, we the whole state takes a day off for it. Like it's like a four day holiday for a weekend. Horse race. It's like a huge day. Yeah, yeah, for a horse wow, race. Wow, that's I kid you not. Yeah. Why don't we do so, that for like the Super Bowl down here? I'm surprised you don't. We actually have I mean it's we, on we have Sunday, our version. So. Yeah, we have our version of the Super Bowl down here. The the what AFL, is it? Like Grand a, Final. a cricket and, cricket or something like yeah, that? Yeah, we, we get a holiday day for that. So don't, I'm surprised don't you don't you have guys kangaroo racing too. Oh, come on, mate. Don't start that cliche bullshit. You're better than that. Come on, bro. I was an honest question. I ride them to work. We've talked about this. We don't race them. You know, oh, so it's, it's like a utility thing. It's like Uber. It's cheaper. It's Uber. Oh, what, yeah. do they call it Karuber? <laughs> Kanguber? Kang, yeah. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Let's roll with that. <laughs> All right. Uber. We're going to talk about the web store today. We're going to talk about the Grand Inquisitorship and why uh, we think there's a lot of dumb things about it. But first and foremost, here's our meme of the week. Waiting. To, for the game to get fun again after Data Quans and the Inquisitor trash. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can see that. Yeah. It's, uh, man, we've had it stuffed in our throats, haven't we? Again, oh, it continues. Gosh. Yes, 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 yes. I, I was, I was giving Heinze crap today because you, you had a bad day in the office in your grand arena, right? Oh, it happens, man. We we all have bad days. You know, we I'm going up against some pretty stiff competition this week. So, uh, you know, sometimes when you uh, go up against them, it just doesn't quite go your way. And that's what you get when you play with Datacrons. Fact. I'm still on a yes. Datacron data strike. I yeah, still have not I, used know. them. I used them. Well, the early days, I used, like, bad ones, like, once or twice. And ever since, never again. I, I came across in, uh, well, my, my guild in Territory came across a particular Datacron that had 93% dodge on it. 93% dodge. 93%. So... That to me is just ab- like, why play? Why why even go up against that team? Well, you kind of have to. It's territory war. You, <laughs> you can't not. You don't but, have to. Yeah. Just don't. Oh, well, in my guild, you do. Just I'm protest. Guild leader, oh. You take it out. No, yeah, well, okay. no, nah, 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 no protest at my if level. If you're in mate. Vanguard, that's uh, that's what. Oh, gosh, it's so no, so it's got to go. All right, Heinze, I want to draw your attention to this post right here. The Grand Inquisitor needs permanent status early, and this is uh, a a couple reasons for this. Mm -hmm. Right now, did you realize there are less than 4,000 Grand Inquisitors in the game? You own one of them. Yes. And right now, this, this poster goes even further to show just how many people even have the requirements met to unlock yeah. the Grand Inquisitor. So we, we only have, in theory, another some six, seven, eight thousand people who are ready to unlock this thing. Um, mm-hmm. So that's kind of part of the reason why I think, apart from the fact that I do think the Grand Inquisitor should be permanently available if we're going to have this ship, at least by the time the ship drops. I think that's just common courtesy based on the ship. We had that for Razor Crest, right, with, uh, with Mando? Yeah. But another side of this is... <laughs> Why is this guy a pilot, man? Like, have they not shoved the Inquisitors so far down our throat enough? To, like... Yeah, no, you're right, you're right. Look, there's a simple, there's a simple explanation, whether whether we like it or not, okay? And and we have to remember this. We we, we have had Inquisitors thrown down our throats and they've said, guys, we're we're making sure that you know it's important to have Inquisitors. They've made us fully aware of that. Uh, 4,000 people unlocking it. I'm actually a bit surprised by that. I think that, you know, honestly, the Inquisitors and Bad Batch, they're, they're pretty solid. I mean, they take out some pretty good teams. And, you know, certainly, you know, I, I used it. I use the Inquisitors to just take out gas in GAC without any issues whatsoever, just as an example. It does some right. really, really good work. It's not trash. It, it's solid. 
and, and it does other work as well, um, you know, and, and it will continue to do so, especially at some point, you know, we'll, we'll probably probably get some some crons, unfortunately, for that team. I mean, it's only a matter of time whether we like it or not. Uh, um, and I don't want to think about it, but it just makes sense. I mean, uh, because if, if you don't use data crons, it don't matter. <laughs> Correct, correct. But 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 uh, yeah. Scythe, the 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 capital. Sh- I think it's great. The the ship. We we need more fleets. We've talked about this time and time and time and yeah, time. Yeah. So four thousand of you enjoy. And 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 one thing that I do like about this particular ship is that you know through conquest it's reasonably accessible. I'm not saying it's easily accessible, but it's it's reasonable if you want to put the work in and the effort. You will unlock it okay. But to have a full fleet where you need one ship and it's <laughs> going to obviously fill in the rest with tie pilots. Uh, Tie fighters. That that's pretty good. That's you know it's a vulture droid again. You know it's basically right. a vulture droid, and and that fills out another fleet. And I think that that's actually a, it looks a like a nice thing. ship. It's just that I I can't eye roll harder that that we need Grand Inquisitor for this ship. I know, but but we've got in the next what six to eight weeks we we have a new territory battle about to drop, and we know that Reaver's the reward, and we know you're going to need Inquisitors for it. It's as you simple as that. Him. You got to farm them. You have to get them because. People are going to be wanting Reva shards because she's going to be OP. But isn't it telling, Heinze, like, look at the numbers here on this post. With how much CG has relentlessly pushed Inquisitors down our throats, isn't it interesting to you that the numbers are this low? Uh, I am actually really surprised, yes. Yes, I am. But but at the same time, I'm not. Because, honestly, there's been a lot of... Uh... At the top end, there's been a lot of turnover of players. There's been a lot of people yeah. walking away from the game a lot recently, yeah. and I think that people because that of have crap been like this, yeah. Th- well, well, this and Crons. I mean, let's call it what it is, and yeah. and I hate going back to it, but it is what it is, and it's certainly caused a ripple effect. It's caused a lot of people to not play the game, or if they do play it, not invest anywhere as hard as they have previously. Right, and and that's certainly a dynamic that we're seeing across the, the game at this point in time. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now let's talk about this. Uh, this bullshit. <laughs> oh, here we go. Okay. So I finally did. Now I, I will give them credit. I haven't claimed these yet. Um, this is yep, nice, right? This is this is okay. You know, uh, we got some free stuff you can claim in uh in the web store. There's also this uh right here uh, with some yep. Hondo and Naka shards. You know, five shards. I'll take free stuff. Uh, forever. But. Yep. I, I just I just want to make a point here, Heinze, and this is probably maybe before I don't know, but the point of this in my mind is they're making themselves the middleman, or they're taking out the middleman, right? Correct. So yes. CG is able, in theory, to make the same profit or a better profit and discount the price for these if we go to the web store, right? Correct. Yes. But let's just compare prices here. All right. Mm-hmm. Unrefined mm-hmm. crystal cash, flash shell, four ninety nine. Over here, mm-hmm. it's four ninety nine. This is it's not yep. this pack. It's this pack, right? Yep. The next one, mm-hmm. refined crystal cash, nine ninety nine. Right here, mm-hmm. nine ninety nine. Right here. All mm-hmm. of these packs, except for I guess it's crystals. You get um, if we scroll down here on the web store, crystals. You get like a little bit more, right? Isn't crystals that what it you is? get five percent. It's the tab at the top. If you scroll to the tab at the top, there's another tab. And we'll oh, take yeah, there, we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. 5% so, more. So basically, all they are willing to do for us, they are taking all of the benefit from this, and they are willing to give us a 5% crystal increase. Yeah, that, I'm that, sorry, that's me. I'm sorry, that's cool. but screw that. Yeah, that's not cool. That's not cool at all. I'm, I'm going to be conservative here and probably say Apple and Google in-game probably take 20%, maybe even more. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna be conservative and say twenty percent, and it's probably more than that, right? To give us five percent when we know that when they do anniversary, you know, releases and stuff like that, they do twenty five percent more, you know, ratios. I think that five is actually a real kick in the balls. I, I really do. I think that's just a bit pure of greed, a, man. You know, it's pure greed. Effort. Yeah, and this is mind you, I, I guarantee you, this is not the devs. This is the EA oh, overlords. No. They're they're the ones who are probably controlling this. So I'm not Correct. I'm not calling Crum out. I'm not calling individuals out. Whoever no. decides this, screw you. I'm, this yeah. is stupid. That that you are cutting out the middleman and taking basically 100 percent of the profit, 95 percent of the profit for yourself. And it, how how do you not 
allow this to benefit the community even a little bit? Considering the way that the game's been lately, and and certainly the overall attitude of take, 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 one-way street, and there's been a lot of that, and the frustrations that the players have had to deal with in this game over the last six months, 5% is just like, it's and just for a drop the ones in the who are still here, like, can you not look at the people who are still playing this game and have, like, maybe look at them and be like, wow, you're really dedicated. If you're still here through all of this crap that's happened, maybe you deserve a bone. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You think that, you know what? Hey, guys, we're just going to give you a bit of a leg up here and promote us wanting you to use the web store. 5%, it's just not even worth it. Yeah. And and let me tell you as well, and this is this is my wheelhouse, Cubs. This is this is where I, you know, this is my this is this is what I'm all about, right? Yeah. Five percent in the grand scheme of things to buy it through that, it it's it's it doesn't matter. It's irrelevant. But one thing that I noticed is that the only way you can actually purchase stuff through the web store is only credit card. You you the, the, you know, certainly there are other avenues through Google and everything, through for instance, PayPal and other other yeah, gift uh, cards, yeah. of course, as that's well. How I, that's how I used to do it when I would, when I would, well. Yeah, yeah, there are certainly other ways that you can actually make payments through, not just credit card. Um, and, and this particular web store, if you have a look, there's only one payment option. If you go and buy something, Interesting. it'll ask for credit card details, and that's it. Um, mm. You know, you don't have to buy one, Cubs, but you can tick, click on it, and it'll, <sighs> it'll ask for card details. Uh, but, this, uh, this to me is nothing more than a conversation of how can we increased profits and this idea was thrown out there and that's it like there, there's no there's virtually no player benefit to this except for a couple free packs which are like okay cool so five hondo shards thank you yep yep <laughs> but 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 for a player who's going to spend this money anyway okay and 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 the and the value certainly and this and is it'll the thing add up, it'll yeah. add up over time on the five percent crystals yeah the, look they will add up yes but but they won't be forever <laughs> you know, and if it is great, but, but the other thing you'll find is, and this is the other avenue, you can actually get rewards as well through, you know, other purchases through Google and things like that too, not just oh, in store. Yeah, there, yeah, there good are, point. yeah, yeah. You know, I, I get so the majority of my credits. 5%. I, I get the majority of my credits because I need to do a lot of remodding for my account mm. with the, you know, the level I play at with war and GAC and stuff like that. I tune through and, and, and just modding in general, just farming mods. I go, I tune through a lot of credits. I get a lot of credit returns through reward, you know, yeah. reward offers and things like that. And, yeah. and that works for me. Yeah. Um, certainly. And that's not available me buying it through this way. Interesting. Yeah. And I mean, I don't really have a pony in this race anymore because I don't whale. So I should be, I mean, as far as the, how this affects me, it doesn't really affect me. It's kind of no. just like the principle of the matter that, that you see CG, the, the, the decisions that are made, how few decisions are made that actually benefit this player base. And the web store at first, when it was first packaged, really looked like an avenue where they could have some serious benefit to the player base. And they just didn't do that. And it's, it's just... <laughs> I sh should we be surprised at this point? But it's just another example. It's just it's nauseating, man. I, I'd I'd like to see offers available here that are more valuable than in game. I mean, if you're going to promote it, you do that. You offer right. extra, not the same. That's what they yeah. should be doing. And yeah. I think that the five percent is rubbish. It should be fifteen, twenty percent minimum, just for the first week. Unless you, know, you see a lot of payment. benefit for buying the five percent in here, my suggestion is give Google and Apple your money. Don't do this crap. I'm not going to tell people how to spend their money, mate. That's not what I'm here to do. All I'm saying is that Probably don't forget. Probably more responsible. That... I'm emotional you... about it. <laughs> <laughs> but you can you can get you can get certainly you know other rewards through other other avenues. They, in game. they yes. could have benefited the community a lot with this and still profited. They could yeah. have. They could have yeah. made that choice and they didn't. Shame on them. That's pretty cool. Someone made it and was probably wrong. All right. Yeah. Oh, okay, Heinzy. We got to get to your video after this bitch fest. But I, I think yours will maybe be a little bit of a bitch fest too, actually. <laughs> well, except, oh. no, maybe not the second the topic. That's going to be that's gonna be positive. You want to give us a little preview? Yeah, look, there's uh, the Datacrons are just released here in Australia, the newest release in the store. And uh, there's some there's a special stat that's missing. Uh, it's called accuracy. We kind of yeah. might need that right now. So uh, we're going to talk about that one pretty hard. Got a great viewer's choice question, actually, looking back. At uh, at the past, which is pretty cool, and uh, of course we need to talk about the new uh, new capital ship we've got coming too. Oh, the new ship, sorry, Sky. Love it. All right, yeah. we're gonna be over there. Heinz's link will be in the description. 
even I, I got to say, you guys got mad at me for not doing that, and I repented, and I do it now. And Heinze, he even the last couple of weeks, he didn't even send it to me. I went out and got that crap and put it in there for you. Yeah, because it's 4 a.m., I forget. That's how much I love you guys. Mm, he does. No one ever, ever know.